Okay, Washi boy, we have arrived in Cartoon Network. I hope you know that dealing with these bastards like this will be very dangerous. The citizens of this town are usually resilient when it comes to one of us attacking them. So don't fuck around. You worry too much, Mr. Sheriff. I make Cartoon Network go boom boom. Save your explosives for later. Right now, I need you to stick with a plan. We are going to detain people out on the streets, and as soon as we have enough victims, we shall transport them back to Adult Swim, where I will await orders from Papa Nicky. After all, it's Papa Nicky who wants their blood. I don't want to die, Sheriff. Please tell me you have my back if these people become violent. Look, Pesto, there's a reason why I gave you a fucking gun. Although I expect you to take them in alive, I want you to use that gun if some of these boys give you too much trouble. Well, okay. Anything's good for me as long as I get your Vegeta. Alright, Anthony. Go and park the van somewhere and wait for my call. Me and the guys are gonna start detaining some victims. Sure thing, Sheriff. Alright, everybody. Let's do this. Freeze. I the police. You are under arrest, you fat cunt. Hold it right there! Get on the fucking ground! I'm an undercover police officer, and you're under arrest for the murder of Tina Culture! God damn it, this is fucking crazy. I can't believe there's some serious police brutality going on out in the city. I would have thought black people would be targeted. It seems very likely that this is Adult Swim with another trick up their sleeves. I mean, I doubt those arrest happy policemen are with a Cartoon Network TV. Which would also mean that these motherfuckers don't have any jurisdiction here. And think about it, you can't just arrest someone on the streets without any justifiable cause. And I'm pretty sure these corrupt law enforcement individuals don't have any arrest warrants for all those people. Look, I know I might not have any jurisdiction here either, but as a member of law enforcement myself, I say we need to stop these guys from giving cops a bad name. Plus your people should not have to suffer from wrongful detention. You know what, Brad is right. And as a matter of fact, I managed to get in contact with a former resident of Cartoon Network. This lady I speak of was once one of the most badass vigilantes this city has ever had. Besides Super Cow, of course. Anyway, although she now lives in Los Angeles, she has agreed to fly out here for a few days and assist Cartoon Network with their potential Adult Swim-related problem. It was such short notice for her, but said she wanted to help. There's the doorbell. That's got to be her right now. Drew, I know this is your house, but I would like to get the door for this one. Go ahead, buddy. Hello there. Glad you could make it. Hello. You must be Kevin. Thanks for calling me. Oh great, my first name has just been revealed on this channel's videos. My mystery status in the Adult Swim is Evil Universe is now partially compromised after 12 fucking years. What? Sorry. I didn't mean to blow your internet cover. You know what? That's okay. It was only a matter of time before viewers had some answers. Anyway, I'm glad you're here. Everybody else is down in the basement. Follow me there. Okay, here we are. Who the hell is this? I'm glad you asked. This is Atomic Betty. When I informed her that Cartoon Network was having a problem with Adult Swim impersonating the police, she wanted to help us out. Betty is a highly trained martial arts expert, and can easily kick the living shit out of these badge wearing bastards. I've heard of this so-called Galactic Guardian lady that once lived here in town. Kevin, I'm impressed that you even managed to not only get in contact with her, but have her fly out here from LA so quickly. Well, Jesse, she really wants to help. Cartoon Network was a big part of her life for many years, and Betty is not about to have Adult Swim manipulate the justice system. And while Adult Swim's involvement is still just a hunch, what I do know is that no innocent person should ever be behind bars. So let's get out there and uphold the law. I've got some extra gear, if you guys need any. Good luck out there.
Stop right there, Candy War! You're under arrest! I don't think so, buddy. You are not a cop, and you certainly don't impress me as one. I'm the real police officer here. Well, officer, you're interfering with a federal operation here. And I certainly have the authority to arrest you as well for obstruction. Bullshit. You are nothing but scum sent by Adult Swim again. I'm not giving in to your dirty lies. Hey, I know who you are. You're that corrupt sheriff from Adult Swim. You've got no business making wrongful arrests down here. Maybe not, but I will do anything to satisfy Papa Nicky. He wants some of you guys locked up in this nice little cage he's got in store for Cartoon Network. And unless you want to end up in that cage yourself, I would suggest that you drop your weapon, surrender immediately, and walk away. Fuck you asshole! I'm not about to let you guys detain random people in this city. You and those men who killed George Floyd give cops a bad name! Fine then. Have it your way. Jesus Christ! They're shooting at us! Betty, let me give you a gun. No thank you, Kevin. I'm all set. Look, I understand you have some of the best combat training, but I insist. These guys are being led by an actual adult swim sheriff and are extremely dangerous. Please take this now. Oh great, I can't believe I'm fighting these guys with a goddamn assault rifle. Watch out behind you! You motherfucker! Hang on, I got this one. I'm gonna flank the Asian guy with a red shirt! I got him. He's down. You cartoon network shitheads will never take me alive! Another perpetrator is down. Hold it, boys. Now you know as a member of Adult Swim's elite force, I can't have you interfering with this operation. And since you've killed two of my guys, I can't let you live either. I'm gonna put all of you down! And after I'm finished with you, I'll be taking those folks we just arrested and putting them all where they belong. Hope you all had a nice fucking life! Holy shit! That was some shooting! And thank you for saving our lives. Here, I'll take that gun from you. Thanks. It was getting heavy. Hey look, I know this might seem like awkward timing, but when this is over, can I please buy you a drink? Actually, I would enjoy that. That's great! Freeze. This is the real police. Where are the hostages you've detained? No, please, I don't wanna die. I'll tell you everything. The hostages are in the back of this van. Just don't hurt me. Alright buddy, I'm taking you in and turning you over to the local authorities. But as I put these cuffs on you, you're gonna give me the key so I can free these poor people you bastards try to hold against their wills. Now move. <laughs>